going to see things which he hasn't seen before. So let's go to the, the eagle. Let me just take my watch off, otherwise I won't. Uh, we'll fly and fly away with time. So we don't want to go there. Um, uh, let's go to the eagle. The eagle can see better than any creature on earth. The eyesight of the eagle is the best of all creatures. The, eyes, the, the eyesight of an eagle is between four to eight times better than a human's eyesight. Can you imagine? Four to eight times better. Um, in comparison, if we had to understand this, in comparison, if we had the eyes of an eagle, if we had the eyes of the eagle, it's about the same size, but it can see four to eight times better. If we had the eyes of an eagle, and we stood on the top of a 10-story building, we would be able to see an ant crawling at the bottom. That is the sight that an eagle has. Amazing sight. From a 10-story building for us just to get the picture, uh, stand on the top of a 10-story building and look down and you can see there's an ant crawling and you can see it clearly. That's the eyesight of an eagle. And, and you see, God is calling us and He's saying, I want to give you eyesight that you will see things so clearly that no one else around you can see. I want to give you that prophetic eyes to see things that no one can see. We in the time now, all over the world, and it's, and, and, and it's chaos all over the world because of COVID-19. And if we look like... A, 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 as a natural man looks and we see like a natural man sees we've got big problems but if we can see like an eagle Christian that God has called us because he's called us and he wants to give us prophetic eyes uh, God wants to give us spiritual eyes that can see things from far away he wants to give us spiritual eyes to see things prophetically. He's taking us into a prophetic season where we'll see things that only God can show us. That's where we go. And that's why I'm not afraid of COVID. And if I die because of COVID, then we can really, then I can be an eagle. I'll fly away, oh glory. Uh, I don't know, but... but uh, why are we so afraid of COVID? We are afraid because it's unknown. We are afraid because we don't really know what the result is. We are afraid because we don't know what the answer is. And we are afraid because we hear voices uh, on, on, on social media. We hear voices from the news. We hear voices from politicians. We hear voices from the health uh, departments. We hear all these voices, but we don't see but when we see and we look and we see that God is, God, God didn't initiate COVID, we all understand that. But God is in control. And God is using the enemy's weapons to prepare his church for a time that we will move in so that the big harvest can be brought in. And if we can see past COVID and we can see the harvest, we'll get excited. If we can see past COVID and we can see that God is busy preparing His church and God is preparing His, His ecclesia all over to, to rise up and take up their position and to see, then we get excited. God is doing some amazing things that He wants to do right now. And Colossians 3 verse 1 to 2 says, If then you have been raised with Christ... Seek the things that are above where Christ is seated at the right hand of God. Set your mind on things that are above, not on things that are on the earth. Now this scripture, I love it in the message. Because the message gives us a different picture of what, what the scripture is saying. The message says, so if you're serious about living the new resurrected, resurrection life with Christ... Act like it. Then he says, Pursue the things over which Christ presides. 
Don't shuffle along, eyes to the ground, absorbed with the things right in front of you. You see, the turkey, we've spoken about that, the turkey's vision, the chicken's vision, is down here on the ground, right in front of them. That's where their vision is. But the eagle's vision is from higher up. Right there.